Here at Idaho State University, instructors can conduct lectures through the Educational Technology Services Video Classroom Network. These interactive video classrooms broadcast lectures to ISU's varying campuses throughout the state. There are some essential pieces of equipment that is required to host a class successfully in the distance learning classrooms. Each room is equipped with both a wireless lav mic or an instructor mic, depending on the instructor's preference. It is important to make sure that the microphone is directed at the speaker's mouth, but is not too close, creating audio that is not understandable. Usually below the chin, no more than six to eight inches. When attaching the microphone, make sure there is a distinct loop in the clip. Also be sure to clip it to the piece of clothing where it will not be rubbing against anything, such as a scarf or sweater or jacket. Also, make sure to keep hair out of the way of the microphone as this will create an unwanted muffled sound in the recorded audio. Be sure to test the audio before the class starts in case of any problems that may arise. This can be done by asking the students in the other locations if the instructor can be heard. At the instructor station is the Extron touch panel. This interactive touch panel allows for the instructor to control the classroom technology and with the push of a button, switch between the instructor video camera, computer presentation, or the dot cam. Every video classroom is equipped with three monitors. One main monitor in the front of the classroom depicting the subject materials that are displayed by the lecturer using the Extron panel and one monitor displaying the far sight for the students in the classroom. The third monitor is located in the rear of the classroom for the lecturer to view the students located in the far sight locations. There is a camera located above the rear monitor that shows the professor, so as they are speaking to the students in the other locations, it appears as though the instructor is looking right at them. Each video classroom is installed with a computer which is connected to a Smart Symposium interactive monitor. The Smart Symposium has touchscreen capabilities that replace the use of a traditional blackboard. Many of the math and science faculty utilize this tool and the software associated with it to replace the use of a dot cam to initially have a digital copy of the class notes. The computer is accessed by logging in with your ISU username and password. Another useful tool to faculty are the document cameras. These are the digital overhead projector cameras that allow for students to see the textbook, photographs, overhead transparencies, or any writing an instructor may do on paper. There are also push-to-talk microphones which are on the desks in every room within each distance learning location. These are used for the students to communicate with their instructor as well as with their peers in other locations. In order to do this, the button on the microphone must be pushed and held in order for the student to be heard and should be promptly turned off once the student is done speaking to prevent unwanted or accidental interruptions. All of the distance learning course sessions are recorded and can be accessed by instructors with the proper form. The form is online and can be filled out to gain access to the recorded session that can be linked to their Moodle course. The recording of the sessions will begin five minutes before the start time and will end four minutes after the end time of the class. For more information on the distance learning classrooms, call the Educational Technology Services 